karibu. Serikali imesema haina nia ya kutuma vikosi vyake nchini Sudan Kusini hadi pale maafikiano yaliyochiwa saini katika baraza la usalama la umoja wa mataifa yatakapotekelezwa. Kulingana na waziri wa mambo ya nje Balozi Amina Mohamed, Kenya itaendelea kutoa misaada ya chakula na hata dawa kwa taifa hilo. Ombi limetumwa kwa mataifa kadhaa ya Afrika kutuma vikosi vya walinda usalama 1500 nchini Sudan Kusini. Ni baada ya maafikiano katika baraza la usalama la umoja wa mataifa ambapo mataifa kadhaa likiwemo taifa la Kenya yalipokea ombi la kutuma vikosi vya wanajeshi 1500 nchini Sudan Kusini ili kudhibiti usalama nchini humo lakini kulingana na waziri wa masala ya nje balozi Amina Muhammad taifa la Kenya linaliwazia ombi hilo countries like uh, um, Rwanda have been approached to provide troops um, we have also been approached to, to provide troops so have many other countries right both in Africa and outside Africa so are we going to see um, troops in, in the Republic of South Sudan well if the resolution of the Security Council has to be implemented then yes you will see 5,500 soldiers uh, on the territory of the Republic of South Sudan katika mataifa ya ukanda wa Afrika Mashariki nchi ya Uganda pekee ndi imetuma vikosi vyake nchini Sudan Kusini kusaidia katika kuyakomboa maeneo yaliyotekwa na waasi na pia kusaidia kuboresha hali ya usalama vikosi vilivyotumwa na Kenya vilikuwa vya kuwasilisha misaada ya kibin Adam ikiwemo vya kula na dawa efforts are continuing by the way uh, i think we haven't stopped not for a second not for a minute uh, because we want to make sure that um, we bring normalcy to the republic of south sudan Taifa la Uganda pia limebuni kitengo maalum cha kusaidia kukabiliana na visa vya utovu wa usalama hasa katika mataifa ya bara Afrika. Itakumbukwa kwamba wakati wa sherehe za kuadhimisha miaka hamsini ya uhuru, Rais Uhuru Kenyatta alitangaza kuwa kubuniwa kwa kitengo sawa na hicho ni mojawapo mikakati iliyowekwa na serikali. Serikali imefafanua kwamba makubaliano ya IGAD hayamaanishi kwamba vikosi vinapaswa kutumwa Sudan Kusini kusaidia katika vita dhidi ya wansi bali ni kusaidia katika utoaji misaada kwa wenyeji. Kufikia sasa zaidi ya watu 1000 wamefariki nchini humo. Zubeda Komekite leo.